to continue with that same example about my going to sleep, my going to sleep, uh, I'd like to use that example to explain what willing the maxims becoming a universal law of nature, as Kant says. I'd like to discuss the relationship with that and what a philosopher named Fred Feldman uh, explains in his textbook on ethics, what he calls a generalized form of the maxim. So notice, in this case, we're talking about my maxim, whenever I'm tired, I go to sleep. Now, the generalized form of this maxim will be something like GM3, generalized maxim 3, that is, whenever anyone is tired, he, she will sleep. And we should see, in general, the generalized form maxim, we just rid, you know, we just replace the instance of whenever I whatever I'm doing, I will or I shall, with whenever anyone. That is, we're making it apply to everybody. So we're beginning to see, so when we're looking at generalized maxims, the question is, you know, is that generalized maxim, and by generalized, the meaning the one that applies to everybody else? Because remember that question that Kant's ethics is supposed to answer, that is, it's supposed to, you're suppo you know, an action is right uh, only if, that the rule you can you could answer the question positively what would happen if everybody did it or would it be okay if everyone in any circumstance acted in this way okay so willing the maximum of action be a universal law is to will that the generalized form of the maxim be applied universally for everyone in every set of circumstances now, to clarify this notion, let's see, let's consider an example, one that Kant talks about, one that Kant talks about, that of the lying promise. And it's the one that we started with. So we have the example mentioned a little bit earlier that I need money, I can get it only by borrowing it, and I'm going to borrow it even though I know I can't repay it. You know, and here's how I might, I, I would proceed to borrow it from a friend, knowing full well that. Well, the maxim of this action is, when I need money and can get it by borrowing it, I'll borrow it even if I know that I will not be able to repay it back. So that's the maxim of the action. Now the question is, can I will that this be a universal law? That is a law that everybody follows. That is, whenever anyone dot 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 and here we're going to see that this is a case where the maxim cannot be willed to be a universal law so here we have the action borrow money on the false promise or the lying promise to repay the maxim whenever I need money and can get it by borrowing it I'll borrow it even though I know that I will not be able to pay. That's my motive. That's my maxim. Now, the question is, the, the generalized maxim, can I, a person, will that, that MA, that maxim, be a universal law? That is, the universal law or the general form of the maxim, same thing whenever anyone needs money, and can get it by borrowing it, he, she will borrow it even, even, even knowing that he, she will never be, will not be able to repay it. And what Kant is going to say is, we can't consistently will, or I cannot consistently will, that that be a law of nature, that that generalized maxim be followed by everybody. Why not? It's self contradictory. That is, it's willing that I borrow money, but willing that the institution of borrowing will no longer exist. And to understand that, let's understand, let's talk a little bit about willing and consistently willing. When we're talking about consistently willing, there are certain things that we might call impossible states of affairs. Think of this. It's self These are the self-contradictory willings. 
One thing that I certainly can will is that I jump up and down. I, I'm not going to get out of the chair and show you, but you know, you can imagine I'm going up and down. And one thing that you can imagine And another thing you can imagine is that I remain motionless. It's hard for some of my students to believe that I can remain motionless, but occasionally I can. But what's self-contradictory, even though willing either of those is okay, willing the combination of the two is contradictory, right? I can't will to at the same time jump up and down and remain perfectly motionless. The idea is if I've willed not to move then I'm going to do my best to try to remain motionless. And I got to do that without changing my first volition, which is jumping up and down. That's just something that can't be done. That is, the, the individual volitions, the individual willings by themselves are con- self-contradictory, but the pair taken together are impossible, are self Now let's just review exactly why Kant's going to claim that in this example, the person can't consistently will that, the person being me, that my maxim be a universal law. Well, where that was my maxim. Whenever I need more money and can get it by borrowing it, I'll borrow it even if I know that I'll not be able to repay it. And the general form of that maxim is whenever anyone needs money and can get it by borrowing it, he, she will borrow it even knowing that he, she, can, will not be able to repay it. Now, in willing that M A be a universal law, I'm willing that, that is, that the GM every will apply to everybody. So, first of all, in willing that M A become a universal law, I want to will two things. One, that somebody lends me money, right? I want this friend to lend me money. That's part of my willing that that maxim, you know, be a universal law. I want to be able to get in on it also. And the second thing is, by willing that everyone follow that, let's see what happens. If everyone followed that maxim, nobody's going to lend any money, right? Because... They can't trust anybody's promises. They can't trust that they're going to get money back. So here's the inconsistency in willing in this case. That is, I'm willing that somebody lends me money in a situation where nobody's going to lend anybody money. So Kant is going to claim here's how his theory works, and it shows why it's wrong for you to try to borrow money on a lying promise. You can't consistently will both one and two in this case.